So you got yourself a Steam Deck and a Windows EXE executable file, and you want to see if you can get it to run on the out-of-box Steam OS using Linux. I'm here to help you do that. First thing you're going to do is hold down the power button, top right of your deck, until it pops this screen up, and switch to desktop. This will take us over to the Linux desktop, which will allow us to add games to our Steam library, which we can then utilize Valve's Proton to translate essentially a Windows EXE over to a Linux executable. It's not always gonna work for you. You're gonna have hiccups, you're gonna have bugs. I'll even show you what that might look like. Um, but get yourself an EXE. You can do it through obviously downloading something through the web browser here. You could stick in a flash drive with an EXE on it and drag it over, whatever you wanna do. I went ahead and downloaded MAME, so I'm gonna be uh, showing you the Windows X64 version of MAME, and we're gonna see if we can get it to work here on deck. So first thing you're gonna do, is, once you've got your EXE on your system, is you're gonna hover over Steam in the bottom right here, and you are gonna go to library. From library here at the top, hit games, and hit add a non-Steam game to my library. Hit browse. If you've downloaded it through uh, the deck here, through the OS, you're gonna wanna go all the way back and go to home and then deck. And then downloads. And then mine is right in here. Once you're in the actual folder, uh, you'll probably want to drop this down and hit all files. It's looking for a .desktop file. Uh, but again, it'll be a .exe in most cases. So mamearcade.exe, I'm going to hit open. You'll see it should automatically put a check mark next to it there. You just hit add selected programs. And now if we scroll down here on the left side, it should show up in our list, which is awesome. The next thing you're gonna wanna do is click on it, click the little gear here on the right and hit uh, properties. From here, click the compatibility option. You do wanna usually click force the use of a specific Steam Play compatibility tool and then pick Proton Experimental. You have a bunch of options here. I found Proton Experimental to be the best. Now, if it doesn't work, you can try other things. There will likely be a lot of cases where these EXEs just don't work at all. It's totally just gonna depend on a lot of factors. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and use Proton Experimental for this. And from there, I'm just gonna hit play and see if MAME works uh, on Steam Deck. Again, it's the X64 Windows executable of MAME running on Steam OS, and you'll see it booted up just fine. If you're familiar with MAME, this is what it looks like. Uh, controls do work, right? So if I come to my game here and hit A, show you real quick that the game itself will boot up. So this is uh, Dodonpachi Sai Daiojo. And I just wanted to test to see if I get it to work, and it works great. Um, I have no issues. It is a 10-year-old game, but it's running via emulation here uh, on MAME. But again, you know, on the out-of-the-box Linux OS via Proton, which is just amazing stuff. People at Valve are absolute wizards. Um, but you'll see, come in here, I'll insert a coin here. I've mapped my buttons already. Right? And it works great. Just to give you an idea there, again, there's my Windows executable, MAME running, uh, and obviously in this case I'm running Side Dojo, but could run anything else on MAME through this. So I'm gonna go ahead and quit. And I'll just show you, so this is all you really need to know. Stop the video now, go ahead, go enjoy your stuff. Um, but some things you may run into that I ran into is for MAME in particular, I'm gonna go ahead and log out, which will hopefully flip me back over to the um, just the main SteamOS UI here rather than the desktop. Uh, one thing I noticed with MAME in particular is that it actually won't run from this other view. And I'll just show you what that looks like real quick. Uh, so for MAME, for what I'm using here, I will have to just boot over to that desktop to run it. You'll see it shows up here and I can hit play. And it even gets to the screen where I can select my ROM here. But as soon as I pick one, there's a little command prompt that pops up, it thinks for a second, and it kicks me back out. So again, no big deal. 
because in this case I can flip over to the desktop view and it works just fine there. But you may run into that. Again, you can also flip through those different Proton compatibility modes and see if any of those will work for your EXE as well. This should work, you know, you can try any Windows executable file. It doesn't need to be a game, you know, I don't know, go wild, Microsoft Office, whatever the heck you want to see. If you can get running uh, on the out-of-box SteamOS, uh, go ahead and give it a shot. Hope this video was helpful to you. Thank you for watching.